see what they're talking about. Because that'll give you the hint on whether or not it's a right date approach to sale. It'll give you the hint on what they're actually thinking about. It'll give you a sense of why they haven't responded to you. You can see all this stuff that they pretty mind me. Just to go spend time watching other people talk on social networks. You know what the number one thing people do on social networks is? Complain. Julian Smith and I had this joke for a long time. Oh, you're a blogger? What do you complain about? <laughs> <laughs> it's so true. I write great people complaints all the time. I, I, I wrote one just the other day. I was at my other favorite hotel in Vegas, the Trump International, and I called room service, and it was like that weird nether time between breakfast and lunch. And I wanted a steak, a steak and vegetables. But evidently the deal was they would only give me a steak and eggs because it wasn't the right time. They didn't have the dinner steaks ready or something like that. I was like, I'm sorry, is there steak in your fridge? Yeah. Can I have that? Yes. But you have to have it with eggs. <laughs> <laughs> Are the eggs stuck to the steak? Because <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'll order that no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> but I've told that story a lot too, right? I, you know, we tell our negative stories ten times as much. That's like a 30-year-old adage that we hear. Oh, the negative story. 